The Parliament of Birds, by Geoffrey Chaucer is a poetic masterpiece that delves into themes of love, nature, and the human condition. Set within a dreamlike landscape, the poem opens with the narrator describing his vision of entering a paradisiacal garden. This dream transports the narrator to a place where he encounters a variety of birds gathered for a parliament, ready to choose their mates. Through this allegory, Chaucer explores the complexities of love and the yearning for union. The poem's structure is framed around the convention of a dream vision, a common literary device in medieval literature. This dream provides a narrative framework for the poetic exploration of love and its challenges. The assembly of birds in a parliament, a metaphor for courtly society, highlights the hierarchy in rituals associated with courtship. Chaucer intricately weaves allegorical elements into the poem, with each bird species representing different aspects of love and human traits. The eagle embodies noble and authoritative love, while the dove symbolizes faithful and gentle love. Through these avian characters, Chaucer offers a nuanced portrayal of love's multifaceted nature, exploring its virtues and complexities. The central theme of love's quest is reinforced through the idea of the bird selecting their mates. The longing for a suitable partner and the quest for love's fulfillment resonate with the human desire for companionship and connection. However, the poem also touches upon the notion of destiny and preordination in love, as seen in the bird's adherence to natural laws and their predetermined roles. Chaucer employs rich symbolism and imagery to evoke the beauty of nature and the intensity of emotions associated with love. Vivid descriptions of the garden, the birds, and their behaviors create a vivid tapestry that transports the reader into this dreamlike realm. The poet's skillful use of language and vivid imagery contributes to the poem's timeless appeal. Moreover, the poem's exploration of courtly love, a prevalent theme in medieval literature, reflects the societal ideals of Chaucer's time. The concept of courtly love, characterized by admiration, secrecy, and reverence, is depicted through the interactions and discussions among the birds. This portrayal offers insights into the cultural values and expectations surrounding love and relationships during the medieval period. The resolution of the poem, where the dream ends before the narrator witnesses the conclusion of the bird's parliament, leaves the question of mate selection unresolved. This open-ended conclusion invites interpretations about the nature of love and its unpredictable outcomes. It challenges the reader to contemplate the complexities of love and the uncertainties inherent in romantic pursuits. In conclusion, The Parliament of Birds is a timeless work that explores the multifaceted nature of love through allegory, symbolism, and rich imagery. Chaucer's depiction of the avian assembly serves as a lens through which he examines the intricacies of human relationships, societal expectations, and the pursuit of love. The poem's enduring relevance lies in its profound exploration of love's complexities and its reflection of the universal human experience of seeking connection and fulfillment in relationships.